What up with everybody? It's your boy, MC Spies, Black Superman, Mr. Health and Wealth. And this week's message is going to be a little intense because I'm going to make a quick suggestion for you. Before you say yes to be a hero, before you say yes to get to the next level, before you say yes to being a GOAT, to being a great, to being somebody who's really going to go places, I'm suggesting you be ready to put in the work. Because I'm telling you right now, one thing that is really starting to bother me, it started to eat my soul up, is people will say yes to an opportunity. People will say yes to a business. People will say yes to a degree. People will say yes to going to the next level. But the moment you tell them it's going to take some work, they quit. They're already defeated. The moment you tell them that they cannot be a victim anymore, they can't blame the government. They can't blame their parents. They can't blame their job. They can't blame their spouse or this person or that person. The moment you tell somebody you are no longer, allowed, you take that V that's on their chest and you rip that V off. The moment you tell them they can't be a victim, that's when they quit. That's when they say, I am not willing to do the work. So I am just making a suggestion that before you say yes, know that is going to take work. This country, this society, this community, this world needs heroes. We're right out of space for victims. We have enough of them. They're here and they're probably here to stay. But if you're willing to be a hero, if you're willing to level up, you have to be willing to put in the work because I'm telling you, it takes work. I will share my own experience with my company and the companies I've worked with. It's crazy because people think they can come into an opportunity like a PHP or Herbalife or Cutco, the different things I've done, and they expect they just sign up and then boom, $2,000 is in their account in three days. They think that they don't have to get a license. They think they don't have to talk to people. They think they don't have to make phone calls. And then in three days, they're going to be a millionaire. It don't work that way. It, I'm just telling you, it doesn't. And nobody's going to tell you that it's easy. It's simple. It has its moments where like, man, this thing works. But you're going to have to put in the work. I'm just trying to reiterate that you have to put in the work. There ain't going to be no shortcuts. And I'm going to tell you something that oh, I had to learn the hard way myself. If you really truly want to be successful or you always wondering, well, what, what's holding most people back or what's causing people not to get to the next level? You know what it is? It's people stay in their feelings. They put too much feeling into it. I'm trying to tell you how you feel and got crap to do with your success. Because I'm telling you guys, I'm always fully transparent. There's days where I don't want to wake up and I don't want to go grind. There's days when I don't want to prospect. There's days when I don't want to make phone calls. There's days when I'm like, man, I really don't feel like running this appointment. I just want to chill like everybody else. But I say, you know what? I can't get in my feelings. I can't get in my feelings. I got to put my feelings to the side. I got to put it inside this little box, throw it deep into the ocean. And only Jacques Cousteau is the only person that can get those feelings. And I got to go beyond my feelings. I'm telling you, there's going to be days where you don't feel like it, but you got to have that same enthusiasm when you first signed up. And we never told you it was going to be easy. We never told you being Superman was going to be easy. We never told you being Wonder Woman was going to be easy. We never told you that being the Green Lantern or the Flash was going to be easy. We never told you that you're going to have to march in the streets and get beaten and get sprayed with water holes and get dogs sicked on you. We never said none of that was going to be easy, but somebody did it because they wanted to be a hero. They wanted to change some people's lives. And I'm telling you, the biggest responsibility that you can have as a leader and as a a hero and as somebody who doesn't want to be a victim is you have to accept the responsibility that you're going to change somebody else's life. One of my most favorite quotes is one man's obedience is connected to so many other people's destiny. So you got to be obedient to your mission, to your calling, to your crusade. You have to be committed because your obedience is connected to so many other people's destiny. But I'm telling you, it's not going to be easy. The moment you decide not to be a victim, the moment you decide to go to the next level, the moment you decide to be a hero, guess what? Man, that sacrifice is going to be next level. You're going to have to be willing to put in the work. So if you're willing to put in the work, 
go get it. If you're comfortable and you're watching this video and you're like, look, Mark, I'm good. I got all the money I need. I got my house. This video ain't for you. But what I suggest is you take this video and you go share it with somebody. You share it with five other people. You share it with 10 other people. The person that you know who wants to get the next level, the person you know who wants to be a hero, and the person you know who doesn't want to be a victim anymore, share this with them. Tag me in it. Share it. Introduce them to my YouTube page. Introduce them to my Instagram. Introduce them to my, my Facebook. Because those are the people who need and want this message. So go out, be phenomenal, and everything you do, always lead with love. Agape love is the greatest form of love in my heart. Because when you see someone and you can better the situation and act on their behalf, man, you make the choice to go make it happen. You master your craft. You have a special gift that God has given you. You master that craft. And you remember the crusade is just to be sold out to serving others. Be sold out to giving your all to better yourself, better your life, and better your legacy. Take care. That's MC Inspires.